Hello everyone, I'm going to tell you a story about how a simple toilet add-on the day assaulted me. I remember it like it was yesterday. It was 2017 Christmas. Well, two weeks before Christmas actually. My wife had been ordering stuff off Amazon, as I've been ordering stuff off Amazon too as well for Christmas. And um, box comes to the house. I'm in the process of opening it, right? I hear my beautiful wife yelling down, don't open any boxes from Amazon. I've, I've ordered your Christmas presents. So I'm like, okay, meanwhile, I've already got this box practically open. Like, I'm talking a little cut. This thing is open. So oh, give it a little cut. Give it a little peek root. Look, I'm like, holy crap. She got me a drone. <laughs> I'm thinking, I got myself a drone. I, I'm going to be the next super pilot drone Flying around, drying, you know, just being the man. I got myself a drone. Anyways, two weeks I'm thinking about flying a drone around my neighborhood. You know, probably chasing squirrels or whatever else I could probably do with this thing. Because, you know, I'm kind of crazy. I'm just going to do funny stuff. Christmas Day comes. I know the shape of the box. It's like, oh yeah. It's like, bap, bap. I'm happy. I'm happy. I'm thinking, oh, it's good. So... Here I am waiting patiently. Open the present. Opening the present up and I'm like, yeah, bah. What is this? I'm reading. I'm like, this, this ain't a damn drone. This is a this is a bidet. A bidet. <laughs> I'm like, thinking. I'm looking at her and I'm not gonna hurt her feelings. And then it kicks in, it's like, holy hell, she got me a bidet. I'm gonna have the cleanest butt. In the whole neighborhood. So, I connected up to the toilet. I'm thinking, you know, I work at it. I'm trying to get it up. It's like I almost got a laser level going on. This thing is like lined up. Bang. It's going to get me good. So, I'm not thinking about this thing. I'm just setting it up. But I'm all happy. I'm happy. I'm ready to go. Now, I'm waiting. I'm waiting for me to do the duty. So, I sit on that toilet and I do my duty. I do the duty duty in the toilet. Now, I have no clue how to use this thing. So, it's got two valves on it. One says wash, and the other one says, like, pressure levels. Anyways, now it's winter. So, our water here in Canada, in the north, it's just very cold in the winter. So, I'm like, okay, sitting there, I crank the first dial. It starts making this weird noise. It's cleaning itself. Well... Okay, wrong one. I turn the other one. I'm sitting there like, geez, I turn that dial full blast. I swear to God, that's like the coldest pressure washer I've ever felt in my life. I, I, I swear to God, it must have been a sniper in the past life because I, or a master carpenter because I lined that thing right up where it was supposed to go. I jump off off that toilet. I swear to God, I have water everywhere. It's all over me. It's spraying all over me. I'm like, help me, help me. Anyways, long story short, that bidet assaulted me. It took me weeks to get up the nerve to use it again. I had to go have a shower after going to the bathroom. I felt more dirty using that thing for the first time. But now, now it's okay. We've got a love-hate thing. I, I kind of just turn it on real slow. So it's like one of those really cheap, like, Water fountains in the high school, we have to get down real close and basically suck on the nozzle. You know, like one of those, it's just, it's just there. It's clean. But it's all good. That's the story of how I was assaulted by a bidet.